I'm ranking the top 250 individuals from the pre-colonial era to today in what is now Canada, and we're on number 177, Mary Ann Shad. Mary Ann Shad was born on October 9, 1823 in Delaware to two free African Americans. Her home was often a refuge for fugitive slaves. In 1850, the family moved to Canada West and settled near what is now North Buxton, Ontario. Her father, Abraham, became one of the first black Canadians to serve in politics when he was elected as a councillor for the town. In Canada, Shad began to work to create free black settlements. She founded a racially segregated school in Windsor, providing education to black students. In 1853, she founded the Provincial Freeman, which published weekly and advocated against slavery. She traveled throughout Canada and the United States to increase subscriptions to the paper and to solicit aid to runaway slaves. In 1855 and 1856, she traveled as an anti-slavery speaker, advocating for full racial integration. She returned to the United States in 1860, where she was a recruiting officer for the Union Army during the Civil War. After the war, she taught at black schools and in 1883, at the age of 60, earned a law degree. She died of stomach cancer on June 5, 1893. If you'd like to learn more about Canadian history, then check out my podcast, Canadian History X, available on all podcast platforms.